In other news now, the National Security Advisor to President Moon Jae-in is set for talks with his American counterpart in Washington. Officials say North Korea's denuclearization will top the agenda. Sohun also says he hopes the visit provides some much-needed momentum to re-engage with Pyongyang. Our Kim Hyo-sun has more. President Moon Jae-in's top security advisor Sohun, who is visiting the U.S., is expected to sit down with his American counterpart to discuss North Korean issues. Speaking with journalists at Ronald Reagan Airport outside Washington, D.C., Sohun, director of the National Security Office, said Monday that it is time to reassess Pyongyang's relations with Seoul and Washington and discuss related matters with the U.S. He's also expected to make his case for the signing of a declaration to end the Korean War armistice as a means to facilitate the regime's denuclearization during his meeting with Washington's National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan, scheduled for a Tuesday local time. As President Moon has been highlighting the need for an end-of-war declaration to bring about eternal peace on the Korean Peninsula, this is expected to be a crucial item on the meeting agenda. This is Sa's first solo visit to the U.S. since he attended a trilateral meeting between South Korea, Japan and the U.S. about six months ago. Pundits are focusing on why Sa's Washington visit has been moved up to this week from previous reports that it would take place around November. It's now left to be seen whether Sa's visit could inject further momentum into dialogue and negotiations between the two Koreas or even between Pyongyang and Washington, especially as it follows the regime's reopening of the communications hotline with Seoul after some two months of suspension. Kim Hyo-san, Arirang News.